from our Center for the Arts studio, this is your AUTV 20 News Break. I'm April McKinney. Thanks for tuning in. The construction of the Rover Pipeline has made its way to Richland County. The new interstate natural gas project will transport 3.25 billion cubic feet per day of domestically produced natural gas to markets all over the U.S. and Canada. Last week, the Rover Pipeline construction caused 50,000 gallons of drilling fluid to flow into wetlands near the Tuscaroras River. However, the Ohio EPA said that no drinking water from the private wells or public water systems has been impacted in Richland County from this spill. On April 20th, the Ashland University 2017 Senior Art Expedition Awards were presented by Chair of the AU Art Department, Daniel McDonald. AU Senior Alicia Jones was selected as the Senior Art Recipient, while Honorable Mention Senior Award was Ahmed Bondanji. The public can see AU Senior Art at Coburn Art Gallery in the Senior Art Expedition, now through May 6th. 20 AU students were officially inducted into the Dwight Shar College of Education's Teacher Education Program on April 19th. This represents students from five different education majors, from early childhood to music education. Mike Buttle from Ontario was the evening's keynote speaker who spoke about pushing the limits in the teaching profession for the betterment of all students. A new segment on Boston's local radio station 89.7 WGBH featured AU's Prison Outreach Program. For the story Lydia Emanuele do, associate producer for WGBH, came to the AU campus to interview AU officials and spoke with inmates in AU's prison program at the Richland Correctional Facility in Mansfield. Emanuele do expects the segment to run later as a national NPR story. Taking a look at our five-day forecast here in Ashland, Ohio, Tuesday will be partly cloudy with a high of 73. Wednesday and Thursday will be seeing highs in the lower 80s. Wednesday with sunny skies and Thursday with scattered thunderstorms. Friday and Saturday will be seeing highs in the mid-70s with partly cloudy skies on Friday and rain on Saturday. That's it for this AUTV 20 News Break. I'm April McKinney. Thanks for tuning in.